So we're going to do the zodiac sign Aries. This could be you who went through this. This could be someone that you're attached to, someone that you have to attach from. This could be someone who wants to come towards you, different people that they're attached to, different people that they have detached from. This is masculine and feminine energy, past, present, or near future. So you have to take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Cups. So this is definitely like a partnership. Um, someone wants to work with you. This is someone that you have a connection with. This could be your two of cups. Somebody is heartbroken. It's like somebody could have wanted to partner up with someone, work with someone. But... Um, now they're going through some type of depression because somebody wants to partner up with someone else. It's like they have, they feel like they have a connection with someone else, mutual attraction to someone else, and they want to work with that person, partner up with them, and somebody is heartbroken. They could be, they could be heartbroken over some type of decision that they made. Yeah, this is somebody that was causing some type of deception. This person was being very sneaky. They thought that they were, um, not going to get caught and they got away with something that they were doing now they're left in this three of swords energy after trying to cause some type of trickery yeah because somebody is moving on it's like they're moving forward they're going towards something different this person is taking action and they're more determined to go towards whoever this person is that they want to partner up with Five of Wands. Yeah, and it's like whoever this person is going towards, this, this Seven of Swords energy, they were in the Five of Wands energy, like secretly competing with that person. They wanted to send like conflict, negativity around that person. And um, yeah, and it's like they could have did this to get this person's attention, but it gave this person the courage to like departure from this person. And just move forward. Knight of Wands, yeah. This is someone that's like very um, immature. And this is someone that, you know, this could have been a one night stand. Somebody that they were just having sex with. And they were secretly competing with you because they knew this person was like, you know, in love with you. You're this person's two of cups. They have, you and this person have a um, connection that a mutual like attraction towards each other and this person was more like a lustful type of energy and it's like they could have been competing like that you know they could have wanted this person to look at them in a lustful way they wanted that person to chase after them while they were trying to secretly like compete with you compare to you copy you something like that Five of Pentacles is here, yeah. It's like they isolated themselves from that person. They left this person out in the cold. This person did this because they were insecure. This is the type of person that used, you know, sexuality to get what they want. And it keeps them in this Five of Pentacles energy lacking. They have a, you know, a lacking type of mindset. They're lost. King of Wands. Yeah, it's like they left this person out in the cold because this person has passion elsewhere. And it's like now that person is more focused on whoever this Two of Cups, this person that they want to partner up with. Whatever this Five of Wands energy is, Seven of Swords, it made this person more focused to see like the big picture of what this person was trying to do. And something was laid to rest. Four of Swords is here. Yeah, they isolated themselves from that person. And it's like if this was sex magic that they thought they were competing with you, they were placing spell work over that person to get them to chase after them or be interested in them, attracted to them, 
that person have recovered from that. They needed to heal their self, cleanse their self, and lay whatever this situation is to rest. So they will be able to move forward. Yeah, to have a new beginning. Ace of Wands is here. And it's like now this person is having the urge to, you know, want to grow. They, they've been inspired to make some type of change. Yeah, Tower is here. This was like a sudden change. Somebody did not expect to see, and they could be going through a Tower moment. They're dealing with an overflow of bad choices. Somebody thought it was, you know, they were going to win some type of secret competition, being very immature, trying to compete with you. And it did not work. It only created a Tower for them. Yeah, that's it. Temperance is here. It's like you're an earth angel. And this entire time you were in this energy of being peaceful. You were praying, keeping yourself grounded. Yeah. It's like you're someone that knows your purpose. You know what you're here to do. And you're also someone that's spiritually protected. It's like whatever this person was trying to send at you, send at that person, they're not protected and they're stuck in that energy. The hermit. And nine of wands, yeah. You could have been in this energy, like if this person ghosted you because they didn't know somebody was like trying to place lustful energy over them, secretly compete with them. They could have ghosted you and then they ghosted that person. But it's like you're someone that's very wise. You were in the energy, as I said, of keeping yourself balanced, grounded out. Yeah, somebody wanted you to feel alone while they were, you know, trying to secretly compete with you. But yeah, you gained some type of courage. Nine of Wands is here. You went through a lot, but you still came out on top. These are people that were secretly like testing you behind the scenes and you didn't know. The moon? Yeah. Somebody was definitely like trying to place an illusion over someone. And they knew that this person was hiding some type of emotions for you with the moon and Knight of Cups. Hiding the fact that they wanted to connect with you. It's like they knew. Hi. And so whoever this person is, they definitely knew. The devil card on the bottom of the deck. And then the lovers. So they knew that this person would be ending something out. With the death card, experiencing a rebirth and starting a new cycle with you. Because this person has a spiritual connection with you. And um, this was a karmic like relationship, karmic cycle, different karmic attachments. And they knew. They knew that whatever this person was hiding. Because they were with the moon card and the devil card. Like, they were obsessively like doing something behind the scenes. And they were expecting for it to work. Whatever they were doing, it's like it has come back on that person and they're not protected. They're realizing that they're physically, mentally, and spiritually lost like out in the cold. They don't have any spiritual protection because of whatever they were playing with. Yeah, this person is binded to the devil. Four of Cups is here. They definitely wanted this person to miss an opportunity on this spiritual connection. And the plan was to keep this person in this two of swords energy, not being able to decide, not being able to make a proper um, decision while they were secretly like copying you, competing with you. Yeah, because they're unhappy. Whatever they were doing, it was rejected. Yeah, and now they're at a stalemate. They don't know what to do. 
Because like this person have already made a decision of what they want to do. This person was being starved because they needed to stand up and like lead their own life. They needed to heal. They needed to go in solitude. Yeah. This person needed to take action towards whatever it is that they were desiring. They have girl with the snake. So this is someone that was very narcissistic. It's like they were charming that person, using that person. And this is somebody that they definitely needed to set boundaries with. This is the seven of swords energy. And it's like they, yeah, they caused it. They, 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 they ended something out with the coffin being here. But this person also caused the ending for their self with whatever they were trying to do. It only created a change for that person. It helped that person go in solitude, lay something to rest, and um, focus on growth to be able to start something new. Mass is here, yeah. This is somebody that definitely, like, they knew that that person was wearing some type of mask. They were hiding their true feelings for you. And it's like they only knew because they were placing like some type of, you know, lustful energy over that person. And they were getting readings to see if that person, how that person felt about them, how they felt about you. And they just kept comparing and competing secretly, like to confuse this person. Yeah. So it's like two different people were wearing a mask. They didn't want that person to knew that, know that they knew. And whoever this person is, that's your two of cups. They didn't want that person to know how they felt about you. Ascending. Yeah, now this person, it's like they've been prepping for union. This person is in a new phase in their um, journey. And they've transcended from whatever these obstacles were. These sneaky tactics. The dragon butterfly. Be lighthearted. Finding out. Things come to light. Yeah. Change and heal. So they found out that this person had to play some type of. Um, this could have been sex magic over them. Yeah. They found out. Whatever this person was doing with this devil card. With this. um, With the moon and the devil. They found out. And that all came to an end. It helped this person to make some type of change. And it definitely helped this person heal. Date is here. So this person wants to date you. Then soulmates is here. This also, with this popping out all, you know, literally in the reverse, this could also mean that this person is realizing this is someone that was like a one night stand. This was like a test. They were going through some type of lesson. And this is someone that they didn't have anything in common with. Like that person is, you know, not connected to them spiritually. This was just a test. They were being tested. Yeah, and this caused a sudden change. They were surprised and they went through a transformation. Lightning is here. Now they're in the energy of keeping a positive mindset after healing. And they're trying to manifest like exactly what they want. And they want to have abundance with you. Yeah, this person wants stability with you, security, growth, palm tree. But they needed this time to um, heal, do shadow work on their self, appreciate their self. And gain some type of self-worth. Self-indulgence. It's like the nine of cups energy. This person needed to be more happy with their self. This was definitely a lesson. 
that this person needed to learn in whatever this toxic karmic cycle um was. Sabotage is here. Yeah. Somebody sabotaged yourself because they were very persistent, like very uh, determined to try to sabotage you, sabotage the connection, and keep this person in like this devil energy, like chained to them through addictions, bad habits, obsessions, and sex magic. Yeah, clock. And it's like cycles, time to heal, pro progress. So it's like this person definitely needed time. So this person feel like the clock is ticking. This person could feel like they're, they're getting older. If they were, you know, attracting different immature energies, they were in an immature energy. And they needed to focus more on healing and growth. talking this person is interested in conversating with you um they could be getting ready to send you a message or something like that but talking and then both they're coming towards you so they, this person have definitely moved on and then you have acts here they separated themselves from that person it's like they're they're not even talking to that person anymore they're focused on healthy choices and love and in life. Yeah, and they're focused on being more happier with their self because they already know that they want to partner up with you. This person has already um, made a decision to come towards you with a romantic offer. 